296 days of our seminary and summer clung just to end it. So the annual problem for Roshana Aleph is finding a good way to spend it. Like maybe learning the Mara, Davening Mincha, heading committee at TBA, harvesting corn on a kibbutz, or learning a whole daf a day. Sing for name, Brock, planting on the trees, you're learning your Bashir its name. He's not a Kotel. Going on to your leave, doing laundry, or driving your teachers insane. As you can see, there's a whole lot of stuff to learn before college starts this fall. Come on, Perry. Go stick with us, cause girls at TVA are gonna do it all. So stick with us, cause girls at TVA are gonna do it all. Rabbi, the girls think they're better than the boys again. This is Major Monogram. Recent surveillance of the Matan building has led me to believe that something evil is brewing. I'm under the suspicion that someone has been sabotaging the girls' natural growth, forcing them to, uh, what's the term? Flip out? not rip toilet paper before Shabbos. Princess! I keep wanting to go to the hotel on Monday nights. Abby, I can't wear Blundstones anymore. They're not Jewish enough. All that's cute on my Spotify now are Shiorim. I went to the hotel and they told me to pull up my skirt because it was too long. I make everyone in my apartment wait 24 hours between using the fridge for milk and meat. Cause I'm really afraid I'm totally loving what's happening to me. Many of the girls around TVA have grown complacent doing things only out of rope, not understanding the meaning of what they are doing, rather just perpetuating an appearance of film fight. Just imagine, Agent P, everyone actually enjoying your life, showing up on time to shuffery, wearing skirts that cover the elbow. As opposed to allowing girls to develop at their own pace, this find has been forcing it upon them at an unnatural pace. They must have the opportunity for self-discovery. I mean, they haven't even signed up for Shauna Bet yet. My only advice to you, Agent, is to keep a close eye on the different contingents within Matan. Okay, I'm on it, sir. Before we begin today, I have a few questions to ask you. Wait, before we begin, can I just complain for a second? Dynamic. Uh, okay, so I really do view all the TV girls as my daughters. Is this sick girl? Please, Everyone thinks I got mono, but that is all cleared up. I can't even count the amount of times I've gone to the doctor this year on one hand. Yes. And then there's just 
follows this whole conception that teaching women Gemara is teaching them tea flute. What the heck is tea flute? Why should I stop anyone from accessing education? Everyone has a right to their tradition if they want to. <laughs> I have a right to my tradition just as much as any man. This is Club 16. Yeah! Woo! Sometimes when I'm alone, I just like to put frozen vegetables on my knees. Being that I'm going to the army next year, I can visit TVA whenever I want and carry on the Club 16 torch while the rest of them are in Gullis. This is Hatsala! If you compare the Yesterday I had no pulse! Oh my gosh! I joined Hatsala because I knew the Poland trip would be co-ed and I wanted to get a head start. someone into adopting radically different beliefs by using systematic and often forcible means. first ever major cell guidance counselor. I know these girls. I understand seminary girls. And you know, this brainwashing for Aliyah, it's gonna do no good. I think you should go on more to Yulene. You know, show them the Eretz Yisrael, and then they'll be able to love the land, and they'll understand they can stay here, and not go back to God. So, you know, I've been in women's education for about 20 years. Uh, I started the MMY, I've been teaching Gemara for a number of years, but uh, a number of years ago I decided to, uh, you know, stop teaching and pursue my real traits in life, uh, which is of course to be a tour guide. I mean, just Israel, beautiful. Matchmaker, matchmaker, make Aliyah! You know, the thesis of my class that everyone should be making Aliyah. And if you're not making Aliyah, you're living your life in sin and are you even Jewish? So I think we have to have more of those Aliyah speeches to really take those girls' minds outside of Kutz Laaretz and bring them here. I don't know, I think you have to have a different approach, you know? If you Religious intellectuals who want to make Aliyah. Is it too much to ask for? Is it? Go on them too strong, they'll be like, oh no, this is where the brainwashing starts. I know it's March, but like, we were expecting it. But I think that we have to have them, you know, more involved in classes. It's almost term, so maybe we can incorporate that. I'm so sorry, Mike. Like, we have so much to talk about. This is such an important topic. Welcome, Sean. Shall we? <laughs> okay. So what I get to have. So Sean and Olaf is really not enough time to get them to fall in love with Israel. They need Sean bet, and they don't just want Sean bet, they need Sean bet. So there's really no reason why every girl should not be considered Sean bet right now. And then once they do Sean bet, they'll do Sean bet, Dimmel, Della, Hey, Vav, and Aliyah. It's so important. Why Sean bet at Gushetzion transformed who I am today? I wouldn't be here right now. I'd be over at, you know, Penn, doing my thing, and TVA would cease to exist. So, if these girls don't understand how pivotal it is to stay, then maybe we gotta find new girls. Cognitive dissonance. I say we have another Aliyah speech. You know, the, all these girls are born into privilege. And you know, my parents gave me a really wonderful childhood 
And yeah, they were upset when little Arnold Wexler went to the IDF. But at the end, they were very supportive. And I met my beautiful Swedish wife across the hall. And you know what? If I can get married to a beautiful Swedish wife, then they will have find their match in Israel. My God, yeah. This Aliyah talk has really had me concerned for both the students and our staff. And you know, she married me for some reason, and even though I only have average intelligence and a genius three-year-old... Is now a good time to tell them that I'm not staying Sean a vet? And then Israel! It's wonderful. They say the happiest people in life sing all the time. So Yocheved has probably achieved that true happiness. Psychologically, if we remind ourselves of three things daily that keep us happy, if we do this over the course of 21 days, we'll achieve great happiness. And that must have been what Yocheved did. You know, I think I think bowling trips are actually not the most successful way of getting a girl to meet Alina. Um, you know, I ran the Shiat Zion trip and I think that was really, really successful. You know, we met with all these leaders and people who really created the state of Israel and it's right from the outside of Israel to be able to appreciate it. We should stay in Israel, we won't appreciate it. Rabbi Bayer looks a little suspicious. Maybe he's been tricking me all along. Nah, he loves the boys too much. Why did they never put Night Seder in the perm spiel? You? Speak of the Tom Lane's been taking books for their affairs. I guess Matan women just think it's communal space, you know, to, to put their books, to take my books, to take my seed to take my Tanakh, to, you know, use my honey that was left there. Yeah, just because, you know, they think that it's all theirs, but really it's not theirs, it's mine. And I bought the honey, and I bought those books. Ah! Perfection. I'm gonna find out who did this.
perfect. I wonder what's going on. Jesus sent me a aquatic egg laying mammal of action. This doesn't really She's make sense. A furry little flat foot who'll never flinch from a fray. She's got more than just my skill. She's got Who could it be? What's going on over there? Hey! Hey, you! Did anyone else just see that? Someone else just climbed up this. What? What? I'm gonna try to get a better look. Pickups are around back. Okay. Hey, you! Tonight's been pretty weird. Let's hear from one of the protesters. Oh, no, no, no. 
Hi, what's your name? Um, I wanted to ask you what your connection to Nechama is and what do you think about this current situation? Well, she's my teacher, she's my mom. And she just vote for her. Like, this is the current situation. There's no other option. Heard it straight from Sophie's mouth. How do you define approaching the elbow? That's an excellent question. So halakhically, it seems based on the mission of Rura, that the show is certainly a place where you don't have a tenbach allowance. Am I allowed to show? <laughs> yeah, till here. So approaching the elbow would be within the tenbach allowance that we have with regard to all makomot sanua shabbat, including this room. What is your favorite facilitator? I was wondering what you think about the spring weather. I love it. Yeah? Awesome. I was wondering if you would be able to pronounce this for me. The low worm chin. The low worm chin. Glue worm chen. Glue worm chen. Ringo bloom. Ringo bloom. Ringo bloom. Ringo bloom. Kartoff shalhem. Portal awful shalhem. Kartoffel shalhem. Kartoffel shalin. Kartoffel shalin. And soup kennelly. If you're reading in Spanish, soup ken asia. And soup and kelly. Thank you. <laughs> soup and kelly. Soup and kelly. What can I say? Yel damas is allemaal. Maar ons aangevaar jylle soos dochters. Lees asjeblief een bykie te wees. Jylle praat te hard. En jy kies vir muziek is nie goed nie. Baie dankie. Okay, sweet. Thanks. You guys know I brought Serena to TV as a madricha. Hadas, win. I know what to do. You see, when I taught hip hop classes at Penn, I was often faced with differing opinions, and I had to figure out a way to sorry, solve those opinions through different means. Hit it, DJ! Yeah.
We're intentionally taking over TVA. What does that mean? I need to be a good mother to my daughter. How do I raise an Esther? How do I raise a root? I only have boys. So it could be Shawnee, because she's like always trying to make us flip out. But all the clues point to Rabbi Saif. Amanda. Amanda. You've gotten so close to figuring out why I've been doing all this. But you're missing one key element. The reasoning behind this is because I want Nijesha Torah Avoda to be part of the joint SEM application. Is that too much to ask for? Why? Why are we not accepted as the norm of that community? It's because we need longer skirts. We need earlier shahri. We need Gary Mahadran food. And you may have tried to thwart me this time, but you will not succeed. The seed has already been planted, and our girls will flip out. Oh my god, what is going on? I don't understand. I'm so confused. Walking down the street, Makane Yehuda, Monday night, nothing much to do, and I sit down. On this bench and I look around Everybody's rushing to where I'll never know Wonder what would happen if they took it slow But their destination is more important, I suppose Too fast to wonder, too fast to care About the person with the clothing Only notice what you wear So what if I believe in God Dog and thrice a day It's that I wear pants and I hang with guys But you look at me that way Don't forget Stick to cover me. that air no It's a little too Wi-Fi. powerful. No TV, it's gosh me I do all my Just meeting in class. Do you think you can head on and just... They need to be stopped. I think it would be much healthier to be welcome to hip hop into our TV as a norm. Basically, he's the OG. He's the OG of the Nike, but I think we should just have Rabbi will come in. In him we trust. He will guide us. Because I'm flipping. Dog's commitment! <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs>